Hi, I'm Brad Nata, owner and creative director of Brad Nata Hair Direction in Sydney. The look we're creating is from the Betty Jackson show, and it was all about fullness, volume, but it had a very natural feel and it looked really effortless. To prepare the hair, I've used sea salt spray, and I've blasted that in to give it texture. And to get the movement, I'm going to use my GHD irons. To create the movement, I'm going to take a section of hair, comb it through, place the irons at a 90 degree, wrap around the iron, and then just slide the hair through. The angle determines the amount of curl. So because we've got it going in at 90 degrees, it's just slipping through the hair and creating a bend. If we take a section and put it in this way, you're creating more curl. So the reason why we change the angle is just to, you know, determine how much curl we're going to get into the hair. So you can see the curl's tighter when it's at a different angle. So keep it at 90 degrees so it becomes more relaxed and more, more natural. So it looks like it's kind of dropped out a little bit. But that, that's the key to, to this look. So now I've got the texture in the hair, I want to create some volume at the crown. So I'm going to do that by backcombing it. So I'm going to start putting the backcombing in. So just take a section from underneath part line. Probably about two centimetres thick, maybe three. We're going to push the hair back into the root area. So hold the section with a bit of tension with this hand and tension in your thumb here, using a tail comb. And then just in one movement, just push the hair back into the scalp. And just probably, not all the way down, just through here to give it some padding. We'll repeat that. In your next section. To finish the look for the Betty Jackson hair, I'm going to flip Gina's hair over and spray it with some hairspray to give me some volume and then we'll flip it back and just dress it out slightly.